That one doesn't. Yeah, it, it doesn't, doesn't change work. really. Um, one thing I always have the feeling is that maybe we could turn the thing upside down. Oh, I can't get into the welding side of the other ship. The turtle. No. Ah, oh, give me, give me a sec. Let me. Uh, it could be that the that it is set to. Uh, let me see. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There's a neat trick that I've I've seen other people use. I was just going to show you. I'm not sure if you know it, but um, uh, let me carefully drive this over there. So, like for instance, the conveyor seemed to take a little while to to actually. Well, you have the speed of the welding increased here, don't you? I guess. Yeah, 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 yeah. Um, um, Erling, Erling, g give me a sec. Um, what we could do to help with um, to help with um, welders, uh, you, so you, with this cockpit you can't see over, kind of over the 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 welders. Maybe if we turn that upside down, we could make it so that the welders are over the cockpit. So then you can see the 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 tips of the welders from your cockpit. Don't know so if we. So you're saying to have them higher or the yeah ship have them ab above the cockpit. That's that's what I say by we we turn that upside down. In space there is no up or down, and um, we could kind of um, we could go with this and have the cockpit where it is, and then just um, move the move the tubes to the top and bring the welders over the cockpit because then we can see the 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 tips of the welders it's it's kind of the same problem with the turtle you can't really see where the where the welders are and if they would be over the cockpit then we could see them oh I see you're not happy with the... No, no, no. <laughs> it, it, I'm comprehending what you're saying. So you'd be actually looking up at them, not down at them. Then. Yeah. That makes sense. They would be over, kind of over your head. And so you, you could see the tips better because you wouldn't have the console in, in, in front of you. Oh, wait. Um, so maybe we move the cockpit a bit more to the front and then kind of uh, where's the block I need the armor block and the welder bring um, bring the welders to I hate the rotating somewhere here and if we would have the cockpit somewhere here in front of the let me take a look at that yeah this somewhere thing builds here. really fast yeah it makes sense um, because we then we could see the tip of it and I think the the view from here is better So let's see where there's a conveyor nearby. I could even I, I could even imagine um, imagine to to really to really go below it. So have the cockpit uh, have the welder one one more to the back, kind of here. So um, with this, you are really really close below the below the welding tip. What you could do then is let me remove this and the cockpit again. We could make the the bottom side um, angled so that we don't ram the the 
the hull into the we always ram the hull into the <laughs> into the thing we want to weld. Uh, let hmm. me. Actually, right on that line, there is a way to get the uh, a conveyor on the top. Hmm. Then let's uh, maybe. I'm do just gonna grab. Just gonna grind out the place where it can go. So the conveyor would be in the middle. Um, then we would have to anchor the, the uh -oh. welder somewhere else. Yeah, yeah. It's so yeah, that's that's the location the conveyor is going to go now. Yeah, so yeah, yeah, yeah. the rest of this can be taken away. Okay, then I can... So, I can rebuild the floor. I, I will. I will do that. Let you can lay out your. Okay. Um. I don't even need like bent tubes or anything. It's just straight on. Yeah. 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 <clears throat> okay. Then I can make the thing bigger again. Uh, I will have to color it after afterwards. Uh, eight and one corner block here. So did you say it should be extended one more past this point, or what did you think? Mm. Like, like up to here, and then the and then the the cockpit the cockpit kind of below that, so that right. we can can the the welding tip then is really really close to the. Really, really close to the cockpit. Um, I'm, I'm not a big fan of the fact that it is uh, kind of an open ship. Then, no, no, no. I would bring it to the, bring it one more to the front. Oh, like directly under it? Yeah, di directly under it. Um, my viewers are used to being blinded by, uh, by welders, so. Um, I will have to move. My only problem with that is like it's got no reach. Like um, you're gonna have a square front end instead of like a pointy front end. I the that is uh, okay for me. It's fair enough. So um, this actually extends like one extra block out at the welder tip, so you get a little bit more reach that way. Uh, 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 so no, it's it's all right. I'm just talking out loud with my, <laughs> no, my thought that's, processes. That's good. Do that. That's what I want you to do. Okay, so. Uh, where the heck? No. This whole rotating tip thing is confusing. Yeah, it is. It is, it is. Okay, I can later remove these blocks. This has to go away, and then I can use this, this, and this. You could actually put a conveyor block here and then have a double layer of welders, depending on how massively powerful you want it to go. Um, do they not have a connector on the top? Uh, just the sides. Well, yeah, let's just build it. What the heck? Why, why go big when you can go overpowered? <laughs> that uh, that argument I don't hear from Canadians a lot. <laughs> why go big when you can? What? <laughs> let's not go big. We will. Go Um, yeah. Seriously. Okay. No, they don't have they don't have uh, connectors on top. So. Uh, I need more armor blocks. I have nothing to attach to here. Don't you have steel? Uh, that's not the problem. I need um, I need a place to actually attach the conveyor to. 
um, six welders. This six is just just gonna be a placeholder. Welders. Oh. Um, what you could do now is give me a sec. Give me a sec. Give me a sec. Uh, yeah, remove that. Put the conveyor there, and then did now you I place the conveyor the there? Yeah. Okay. Then we can remove these again. Whoops. That's the one I want to keep. Uh, we don't need because the the sides have openings, so they are connected. Oh, I was gonna stack another row on top here. That yeah, was yeah, 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 yeah. I I know, but they are, they are interconnected, so we don't need the one on the sides here. We can just use armor blocks here. That's that's give us that conserves a bit of a bit of steel. If we just go with armor blocks here on the side. So. And we could also go with a with a tube there. Oh, okay. Like a bent tube on this one yeah. spot. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Makes sense. I don't know what the difference is, but... There is none, I would say. Aesthetics. This, yeah, this thing will not be really aesthetically pleasing, so... But it, it's, it's a working ship, so... Um, at the moment, I'm kind of building my fleet of uh, construction machines and <laughs> transporting machines and all that stuff. Later has has come oh, has yeah. to come the the era of uh, building crazy military ships. I don't need because I don't have anything to fight here. Um, Okay, I still want to add the cargo container on the on the back side. So Okay. <coughs> wow. <laughs> ah, this thing will look crazy. Maybe I can move the thrusters a bit more to the back after that. I think I will do that later. I don't know if they're obstructed. Like, are they s in a safe area now, do you think? Or is it too close for comfort for you? What do you mean? The the thrusters? Yeah, the, the, the like the backup thrusters. Yeah, the back thrusters. The back thrusters could be. We, we have to add some on the front. Oh, yeah, there, there are, there are. Okay, that that they they could be okay there. I'm I'm again. I'm normally I'm trying to close my constructions so that the that the constructions kind of are uh, airtight, <laughs> and um, we could glass this in at the front here just to make it nice. But yeah, we 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 will I have to do something like that. That 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 is my. I, I talked about OCD with Armitage, I think, but th this is my OCD. I want to have the 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 ships airtight because they are they are spaceships, and spaceships are not open and not. <laughs> it's it's one of the things that really really disturb me in in space engineers that you you are constantly in this suit. Um. I need uh, interior plates. Okay. Uh, what? What was I doing? Okay, the the cargo container. Display motor computer. Okay. Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> I'm Sorry. No, no, okay, no problem, no problem. I'm, I'm ramming you. This is so fast, it's like pretty much done as soon as you get to where you're going. <laughs> yeah, it's, uh, I, I really have to see if, if I will keep that. Um, if I the really, only thing really want to keep that. 
the only thing about the small ship design that has a lot of merit is that uh, um, like rubbing the welders into things doesn't really do any damage um, with the small ships. But the big ships, you can really destroy the... the um, yeah, the, the other ship, if you, if you ram it. But on the other hand, I, I can... Yeah, again, I can just throw ores into this thing and it will produce its own its own materials and that is a thing i i really dig 